god, that's gonna play through again. Wow, we 40 months. I'm happy to have supported for this long and can't wait to continue supporting. Press slide. <laughs> if Brian want to do those messages again. It's okay. Don't you worry about it. <laughs> Check 20 cans. See star can chance. Oh, I've definitely checked more than 20 at this point. <laughs> Maybe I should have been counting how many cans I've actually checked in total. My body's like, okay, get the illness out of the way. <laughs> But like, what do you mean four different things? It's I again. I I don't really tinker with mods in any game other than now, FF Seven and Stardew. Those are the only two I've ever done. Okay, so we are again doing our Joja run. If you guys haven't already seen, playing as Joja uh, on Joja Farm. Uh, our main goal is just earning money. This isn't like a full. You know, big old playthrough. I'd like to roommate Krobus if I can, because I've never done that before. Um, but aside from that, we're not like um, doing a uh, a full full playthrough. We're pretty much just aiming for the achievement. Uh, we have purchased one of the JoJo upgrades so far. I think there are like six in total, and purchasing all of them is what you need to do to get the achievement. So, it's we're just about money. Not the starting episode, don't we start this last Saturday? No. Oui. Last Monday. Last Monday. Oui. Oh my goodness, there's so much happening at once. Oui. <laughs> Hi sir, good morning. Oui. I'm a rainbow. Oui. Sudowoodo. Gyarados, nose pass. Oh nice, look at you go. We do love a randomly obtained shiny. But yeah, we're like midway through summer, a little bit more than midway actually. We got our, our little field here going. Uh, I don't think I planted more melons, did I? Did I? Are there seeds here? I can't tell. I assume there are. King Zora looking for the bathroom in your house. Oh, joke's on him. We don't got no bathroom. We're not that fancy yet. Hey, you derived. How are you? Welcome on in. And quick Nova, good morning everyone. Where do we poop? Out in the bush. As as nature intends. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. No one poops in these games. Oh, that's the true secret. Oh, were you woken up? That's unfortunate. I hope that you, you know, got enough sleep. No pooping, only capitalism. <laughs> That's pretty much the, the, the gist of this playthrough. Bathrooms are a myth in games. Alright, listen, I'm just saying. Harvest Moon and Story of Seasons of Wonderful Life had a proper bathroom. I'm just, I'm throwing that out there because it's one of my favorite games of all time, but like, you know. Okay, so let me read this from Mitsu really quick because we're talking about the modding of Scrim. As you mentioned, Console on console, there are normal mods, mods by approved creators, which is just Bethesda's way of saying these are good mod creators. OG creation club stuff, which is what they came up with before, which you bought. These mods are commissions. The creator got paid for their time. And finally, there's the new creation stuff, which is approved mod creators can charge for their mods, which they get a cut of. Okay. That's interesting. <gasps> Gamer Master HD, hello. How are you doing? How was your stardew day today? Welcome on in. We were just getting started here. I hope you guys had an amazing stream. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining us. I didn't take note of what our fortune is. Uh, okay, so we're having a good day. Maybe I'll try mining. Maybe we'll try mining. Uh, so we have this and this. Welcome on in, friends. I hope you all had an amazing stream. Uh, if you're not already following Gamer Master HD, you can go ahead and drop them a follow right up above there. Um, and if you are new to my stream, my name is Crystal. I'm currently attempting my very first Joja run in Stardew. Uh, and so far it's been, it's actually been quite fun. I've been enjoying it a lot more than I thought I would. <laughs> Mike said, <"Ooh." laughs> And yeah, we just, we're in our first summer here. We're just slowly working. We have our first chicken coop being built right now. 
<laughs> no, I appreciated it. See, that gives me a little bit more insight. I had no idea there was so much going on. Only a truffle away from my community center. Yes, yes, I am not joined on JoJo just yet. Oh my goodness, one truffle. Oh, I hope you get it quickly then. Lee, you enjoy your lurk. Oh, and also a question of the day for those joining us. Uh, what would you like to see added to the 1.6 update for Stardew? If anything, you know? If anything. Stardew itself is awesome. I'm not saying it, like, needs a whole bunch of stuff added to it by any means. Oh, and also, if you guys need to get up and, like, do stuff post-stream, please feel more than free. If you want to, like, raid and run or raid and lark, absolutely. More crops is what I want and more fish. Oh, I'm here for that. Okay, Jas, you need to, like, boogie on over there. <laughs> raid and poop, you could do that too. No judging. She saw nothing. Go on, keep moving. I need to find my hat. <laughs> Oh. I don't really care what Lewis thinks. <laughs> Screw him. Capitalism, baby. This is pretty much our entire place. <laughs> oh, you want your current save to be compatible? I'm sure it'll be fine, hopefully, maybe. Trash can hat equals best hat. I'm very partial to the blobfish mask, I'll admit. Give me more of the different colored animals. Oh, yeah. You know what? Story of Seasons, Friends of Mineral Town, like not the perfect game by any means ever, um, but very enjoyable. But I really appreciated like the different colored cows and stuff in that game. It was very cute. <laughs> oh, Mike, them's I. Oh, those are dangerous words, hon. Oh no. So what Mike has just said, because I know you guys can't hear him, is how about patch notes saying this is the final update working on number two. I don't... I don't know. I'm... I don't know how I feel about that. I like Stardew. I'm fine with just Stardew. I'm excited for Haunted Chocolate here. I don't think there needs to be a Stardew too. as weird as that sounds. I'm not against the idea, but I don't, I don't want to put pressure on him as well. Star 2 Valley. <laughs> so close to perfection, even if I need to do more stuff after the update to keep perfection, I want to be able to achieve it regardless of how long it takes or how long it will take for the update to release. Feels like he says that in every update, but never in the notes. Yeah, he tends to be like, yeah, this is it, and then there's more. Moondoo Village. <laughs> You can't pre uh, more, put more pressure on him than he does to himself. This is true, and I think that's partially why I'm all- even though he will never ever hear me, you know what I mean? Like, I never want to bug him because I know that he does so much for himself. <laughs> no, 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 heck. Pulling a Miyazaki, pretty much, yeah. Pretty much. Blatista, Joja is doing good. We are uh, doing a little bit of mining this morning. Polish word for egg. Oh, I did not know that. I did not know that one. I think my favorite thing with Concerned Ape, though, is every- I feel like especially- I, I feel like they did hype up 1.5 and they did mention it was going to be quite a substantial update. But there's been a couple other updates before that where he's like, no, it's going to be quite small and it like added in so much. <laughs> and it's like, dude, I don't think we have the same idea of what the word small means. I think we have very different opinions on that. <laughs> Okay, uh, 
so I'm pretty much just down here looking for copper at the moment. Uh, just a little bit more. Hey, you were played. How are you doing today? Welcome on in. I'm doing good. I'm playing more Stardew. <laughs> I've just, I've been so excited for stream. I'm always excited for stream, don't get me wrong, but Stardew just gives me a little bit of extra oomph to my day and I'm like so excited to get going. There we go. That was it. Uh, Holding a polka doll. I don't know where he got it, but I don't want to take it away from him. You shouldn't. That's so cute. It's the opposite limit what can do in a day. I worry for his stress he's likely giving himself sometimes. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, all right. Just finished. Oh, a D and D session. I hope you had fun. All right. Let's see here. Get some more, uh, more iron. Probably start upgrading our pickaxe here soon. After we get the next Jojo upgrade, actually, I think. Oh, we got another diamond rock. Look at us go. We got two diamonds. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> I'll take that. No complaints from me. Oh, excuse me. Hi, hello. There we go. We had a lot of fun. We almost died 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh, man. As someone who's never played much D&D, it just, out of context, it sounds hilarious. I say much. I say I've never played any D&D. <laughs> Crystal using up her trash can luck for double diamonds. <gasps> Don't say such things. Don't ruin my luck. Actually, wait, no, I shouldn't be talking about my luck. We found out the hard way during Final Fantasy IX. I can't talk about it. Just like Bruno. Ow. Eh. Go on, shoo. God, this is going really poorly. <laughs> okay. There we go. You should play D&D. Everyone should. It's the best thing. I think the thing for me would be finding a group of people who I feel comfortable just like being that silly in front of, you know what I mean? Or mostly, not even silly, like just being creative in front of. I think that's something that I might have some trouble with. <laughs> Dunkin' Donuts. Mike was eyeing Krispy Kreme apparently this morning on Uber Eats before I made breakfast. Oh, Deadly Sun, definitely, definitely. Equally had streamer luck in FF9 as well, though I really did. That was crazy, especially towards the end. The ghost death cry has been forever ruined for me by Pepper. Really? I always try to mimic it. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't? <laughs> Did say I would run a tabletop RPG game for you. I could probably, I could probably be, be silly in front of you, Itzy. I could probably do it. Maybe. A little bit. <laughs> Oh, you want to try to get in, in the JoJo run as well, too? More power to you. There we go. Okay, so it's 7 o'clock. It's a little later than I would like. I think I'm just going to head straight down. Does give us this very good item you otherwise have to rely on for RNG? Oh, wait, does it? Really? I didn't know that. I don't think I... I can't remember if I had an auto header in my... Last playthrough. Yeah, uh, Random was saying that through the Jojo route, you're able to get one without, like, the RNG needed that you would have to face otherwise if you weren't doing Jojo. Mm-hmm. 
love playing D&D. &D. My parents taught me how to play and I've been playing for almost 20 years. D&D can seem difficult if all you know about is what you've seen online, but it can be a lot more casual and chill than that. If you get the chance, I heavily suggest trying it. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, after that game on, uh, on Wednesday, Paladins, that was a lot of fun. So maybe that would be a nice way to kind of dip my toesies in. Community center route puts the auto pattern in the skull cavern chest. Oh, there it is. But it's RNG if you get it, and also RNG getting a chest floor, yeah. Oh, did you post one blue? I'll have to check that out. Okay, it is getting late and I'm not close to the end here. It's okay if we don't reach it, but I also would like to get to floor 70. Yeah, like actually going on silly adventures with friends, exactly. Joja just lets you buy it from Joja. Yeah, so you don't have to worry about getting on that floor and everything anymore. Just don't want to play with my grandpa anymore. He hoards all the magical items. <laughs> Grandpa's like a, a dragon. Just hoarding everything. Okay. I have a feeling we're not gonna find this this floor down, unfortunately. It was a good run though. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. Today was not the day. But we did get some diamonds, we got a lot of ore, so. Oh, wait a minute, nope. I know, we almost reached floor 69. <laughs> that was, I wanted to like joke about that and then of course the game's like, no, you're gonna stop on floor 68 and you're gonna like it. <laughs> oh yeah, I hear you, I hear you, game. Oh, okay. Um... No funny number for me, no. It's a shame. Okay, so while I'm thinking of it as well, by the way, uh, I don't need that many. I'm going to keep one, again, for crystallarium purposes. Um, but the rest I certainly don't need. Okay, and I'm going to put something in here to... Uh, whoops. To process. For combat. I still can't believe we got the Mar person again yesterday. That was crazy. I've I've really only ever seen it once before. And the fact that I've had it now twice in this singular playthrough. What did I do? Oh, I made a chicken coop. Okay, yes. I have done that. I've also not checked my <laughs> my TV. Uh okay. It is gonna be sunny tomorrow, and it is it's a neutral day today. Is it Livy? Welcome on in! I hope that you're having a great night. Use up your trash can luck for the double per mer person. I mean, maybe. Maybe. Did I already gift Shane this week? I have not. Okay, so I'm gonna bring a pepper with me. be a big spender soon at this rate and then I'll be banned. That's true! You guys who've been voting know you guys have been making some bank off of uh, 
offer your predictions here if you're able to, to actually bet your channel points. Absolutely, Pat. I appreciate you. I appreciate your lurk. I hope that you have a great day. Thank you for popping into chat for a bit. There we go. Um, so... I'm just gonna go ahead and clear that away a little bit. You're getting a little close there, grass, and I don't appreciate it. I guess we can also go and buy a chicken here. I think today might be a fishy day. Yeah, look at that. All done. Okay. Oh god, wait. <laughs> Mistakes have been made. Um... I know, I know, that's the unfortunate bit. At least it seems like people who can't bet channel points, at least you can still participate. You just, like, can't do anything with said channel points. Okay. So, let me see here. Um, I don't think that's the path I usually use. Let's see here. I guess it doesn't really matter either way. Oh. Oh, I actually did enough. Wow. Cool. All right, so there is our chicken coop done. Start adopting the babies anytime. Need to edit some music. Oh, but you're procrastinating. Well, hopefully you can get it done at some point. All right, and uh, yeah, let's put in more of this. Do I need to have... I don't need it on me, right? I don't think I need the, the ore on me for that quest. Uh, I'm gonna bring these bars over. Oh wait, no, I guess I'm waiting until after we get the next uh, Jojo upgrade. Never mind that. Um, I can take these in, I guess. Don't know if there's anything else I need to donate. It doesn't look like it. Cool. Let's go check for our trash can hat. <laughs> Affection, you're gonna ban him? God, that's so funny. People advance crafting info in the sink. Let's see how many stuff you've crafted in the past. Yes, that was very handy when I was trying to make sure I made everything. Three red snappers. Well, I was going fishing today anyway. How long have you been streaming? In total? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Lewis. <laughs> uh, in total? God. I want to say like seven years? Maybe a bit, tiny bit more. I wasn't very consistent at the beginning. Um, if you just mean like today, I've been live for like 40 minutes. <laughs> I just saw the big center I'm way far away. Have you ever tried fishing in the park fountain? Um, maybe? I don't remember. Is there something you can get from that? I know there's little things you can do to unlock some cute little things. I need to talk to you first, like this. Some wood. I think it was the trash can that I wanted. I seem to remember that. Seven years, four minutes. Tomato, <laughs> tomato, potato. <laughs> yeah, I've been doing YouTube for, it was last year, it was 10 years. 
Um, but streaming wasn't from the very beginning, and it also wasn't very consistent at the beginning, so... I could afford Big Spender, but I'm hoarding my Peach Points. Maybe one day I'll make something that's worth even more, but... We'll see. Yeah, you guys mentioned the garbage can. I think that's what I wanted. I was trying to obviously collect everything before, so... Yeah, new reward. There we go. Seven years ago was when the Switch came out. No, it would have been it would have been more than seven then, yeah. It would have been more than seven. Yeah, probably closer to eight then. God, that's a little weird to think about when the, when the Switch came out. Yeah, I used to, like, I only streamed on the weekends, or I only streamed for, like, maybe an hour or two. So, it was, it was, it was a different time. Crystal, I have a news story and weird things that happens in TV news. MCP, do share, do share. MCP here with the T. There we go. Are you my best friend yet? <laughs> Gosh darn it, Shane. I haven't even gifted any of the other, these other people. It's okay. One day. Watching your ACNH stuff on YouTube, but not getting to your stream until last year. I do appreciate that, though. Only 2017. I feel old. Isn't that so weird? COVID really threw my sense of time off. I did. I used to put out little videos because I didn't have an audience on Twitch. And I was like, okay, maybe they'll come on over. And then barely anyone did. <laughs> A couple of people did. My reporter asked for gas money exchange for an interview last night. He told her we could meet at her house and then she proceeded to ghost him. Oh. Well. That's a thing. I did. I appreciate that. 2020 was a long couple of decades. It, like, I wouldn't be surprised if in the future they do some studies and, like, people age faster during that time just purely because of stress. <laughs> okay, so we're trying to get three red snappers for, uh, I think it was a Willy. That was a first, not gonna lie. I can imagine, that's so strange. True. True. Mike was saying there's probably also a bit of a population boom around that time, potentially, just because everyone was locked inside. What else are you gonna do? <laughs> are they a rain fish? Really? I did not know that. Willy just screwed me over. I don't think we're having rain tomorrow. I had no idea. It is a red- oh wait, really? I have the wiki up. Yeah. You're absolutely right. I feel, I feel jipped. No, sorry, not the right word. I feel tricked. That's the right word. How dare they? I had hair when I first followed Crystal. You followed Crystal in a previous line? <laughs> it was random's hair life. few previous lives I keep becoming bald. I still think it's really funny that I knew random before he knew me because I'm the biggest lurker. <laughs> oh you know what I was thinking of this fishy it's the smaller red one isn't it? I used to see random in another stream that I only lurked in I never spoke ever. I was too shy, and also half the time I didn't have a Twitch account, and then I made one. Because I'm like, why am I not just signed in? <laughs> um, and uh, I saw him in there because she, she played a lot of Mario Kart. And of course, Random was there for that. Uh, and then he popped into one of my streams, and I'm like, oh, I know you, but you don't know me. This is weird. <laughs> Yeah, 
It was funny though. See, here's the thing. It, there wasn't baby, baby Park back then? No, wait, was there? That was like original Mario Kart 8 on the Wii U days. I wasn't Baby Park added later on? Yeah, that was that was before DLC. So funny. This is the good old days. <laughs> I've actually heard from like I think it was Mendelin who watched a lot of my streams on YouTube first before coming over to actually hang out in, in chat in stream. Oh, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. And uh, so Mendelin came in and like obviously was watching me, knew me, but also recognized a lot of the regulars in chat. <laughs> so that must have felt kind of funny. I read Baby Park and automatically did the Baby Shark song, but with Baby Park, <laughs> we can start doing that every time from now on. You can sleep at night and be happy. <laughs> Was it after they introduced um, Baby Park that you started balding? Could that could that be a, a cause? Hey, I hope you're having a great day. Welcome on in. Thank you for joining us. It was a double dash track. Oh yeah, which is what you're most familiar with. Yes, yeah. Before Mario Kart 8, I played a lot of Mario Kart DS, uh, which I tried to go back to actually not that long ago, just out of curiosity to see how it looked. And one, oh, those graphics are crunchy. <laughs> and two, um, I don't know how I raced on a D-pad. It's very uncomfortable. Saw a few of the old New Leaf tutorials on YouTube, didn't subscribe or anything, just watched them all. Then like two years later I clicked through random, just chatting streams, I recognized the voice and stuck around. Oh! That's such a funny way to find me. Our cart DS is rough now. It is. It is. But uh, when I first got my DS, I don't remember exactly why it happened like this, but I got my DS essentially for Christmas, but I got it like maybe a week or two early. And I, I don't remember why I would get it early, but I did. And it came bundled with Mario Kart DS and it was the red one. And it had like stickers that you put on your 3DS that were like Mario Kart themed. Um, and that's all I had. I didn't have any other games to play for like that period of time between when I got it and actual Christmas. So I sat there and played it relentlessly <laughs> for like two weeks. Uh, and then I got Animal Crossing Wild World, Dogs, and Sims 2 DS. So that was, that was a really good Christmas. More money to buy Pepsi with. <laughs> no more money to buy Cola, I know. We shouldn't let him poison himself like that. I should probably do my yearly check on my Nintendog. Oh, I still wish I had my original Nintendogs. I uh, I had a very bad habit as a kid of restarting my games frequently, and that's what happened to my Nintendogs. There we go, got a library book. Crunchy is really the best way to describe Mario Kart DS graphics. It is, it is. And it's, it's funny because it, it's the 3D. You know, or like the, the pseudo 3D, whichever way they did it. Um, older, like, 2D based, like, sprite games and stuff, I wouldn't necessarily call it crunchy. But that, like, the early 3D. <laughs> oh, you have Daisy. I named mine Lucky because those, I know Daisy was one of the, like, default names. And then Lucky was the other. And then Maxwell was the third one. I was uh, lucky and he was a little like blonde chihuahua. And you have your real life Daisy too. Mm -hmm. 
Mario uh, 64 DS was my first Mario game, or a game where you can't, don't star as Mario. I, I own that game. Um, one day I want to go through that because I've heard it's actually really, really good. It's a very great port. Um, but I've just, I've never sat down for it fully. <laughs> Jacob, oh my goodness, I appreciate you. <laughs> I did. June 27th, 2020. Oh, what was I doing? What was I doing with my life? <laughs> I did uh, order in some more G Fuel. I think I mentioned this last week, actually, uh, that I'm going to be trying on stream with you guys at some point. I'm very excited for that. I'm hoping they come in soon. Is it actually better than regular Mario 64? Maybe one day we'll check it out. I do own it, but of course I'm probably going to end up uh, playing it through other means just to make it look better on stream. But yeah, I've, I've never... I've never properly played it. Hey, Mosh Bikes, how are you? Should I attempt uh, getting the easier bundles done before switching to Joja? I mean, I know the vault is cheaper than the bus repair. But the room seems easy, but the greenhouse I might get from Joja because summer at the earliest I could work towards mine. Honestly, I'd say that's a good idea. Um, at least that's the way I'd probably do it. Oh, what was with that quote there, random? Okay, uh, let's put in some more, more copper. Enjoying the Sunday, that's what I like to hear. That's always good. Oh, okay, okay, I see. I was just like, why? What was that? <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Okay, um, yeah. Hopefully we have another blueberry harvest soon. <gasps> Did we just have the meteor? Oh, I think we had the meteor. Please don't be somewhere stupid. Please don't be somewhere stupid, game. Do, uh, please, be nice to me. An explosion was heard in the night, you don't say. Where is it? Where is it? Okay, it's blueberry day. Get your pop cats ready. Oh no. I have a bad feeling. <laughs> Directly in the middle of the blueberries. I've seen someone who had their spawn like right, you know, in like this area, but on the uh, on the four corners map. So they couldn't leave and it's like, oh, that sucks. <laughs> that really sucks. I didn't think I had enough uh, space cleared for it. Hello? Yeah. Oh no. No. You know what? It could be worse. It could have hit my trees. It's fine. It's all good. All right. Get your pop cats ready, friends. We're going to be harvesting blueberries. is better than cola it makes sense especially pepsi max i think at some point we need to do the pepsi versus cola poll again because we haven't done that in a hot minute and i feel like my chats i think we've, we've shifted you know grandpa can look at a cool rock <laughs> all right are y'all ready wait what is the what's the thing again is it pop and then capital cat There you go. There's your pop cats. It is time.
We love a bit of food drink controversy in this house. Uh, I think that's like our longest standing like debate on stream. More of a Fanta person? I can respect that. Look at this ketchup all on. Okay, I don't want I don't want Pepper to come after me again. <laughs> I respect her way. Oh god, okay. In the bin. <laughs> Okay, uh, so we're keeping these, we're not keeping these. There we go. That was, that was a good harvest there. I can't remember how much chickens cost. I imagine they probably aren't that expensive. Oh, you know what? Okay, Faye, I'm gonna be honest. I'll be very honest with you guys. I also put chocolate in the fridge. Um, and one, I just prefer it like that way. And I, I get it, it's weird. I totally understand that. Um, but two, it's like, I also know that it's like safe. I don't know, I have weird things about that. <laughs> I don't know. Mike's judging me. These are the conversations I like. How are you doing, Andrew? You're gonna get a can of Pepsi Max? Enjoy. I drink two soda-like beverages, orange soda and ginger ale, occasionally Sprite. Oh, you reminded me. I don't think I've tried the black... There's like a blackberry uh, can of dry ginger ale here now. I really like the cranberry ginger ale. So I need to try the other one at some point. Tastes too waxy for you. That's fair. That's fair. And like, I totally, I can understand why people wouldn't like it cold and would, would find it waxy. Um, I just, I don't know. I still like it that way. You put it in the fridge too, Rickleid. Buffery ginger ale is so good, but very sweet for you. I get McFlurries without the chocolate in because I just hate cold chocolate. <laughs> That's true. Mike is saying it might also be a difference between like North American and European chocolate because our chocolate is very different. Thank you for the follow. Don't eat them right away or if it's a hot day. Yep. Yeah. I stopped doing Coke versus Pepsi. I've stopped drinking both. I mainly drink Lucozade? Lucozade? Pink lemonade? I don't know what that is, but I, I want to try it. Husband likes it in the fridge too. I prefer Pepsi to Coke and even mix my beverages with it instead of Coke. Using hoppers to safely put bombs into deconstructors. Stop sending me bombs in the mail, Kent. <laughs> I should put ketchup on my warm chocolate and enjoy that with a nice glass of Pepsi in bed with my socks on. Okay. Listen, I'm also a, a sock wearer in bed, but listen. <laughs> There's a lot that should be done and that's not it. Chocolate in the fridge disappear. I don't mind cold chocolate, but sometimes I like to put Reese's Cups into the microwave for like 10 seconds. So good I live on it. One day I'll try whatever you guys are on about. Um, So it's not raining, so I can't catch that fish right now. I don't have any rain totems yet. Willie totally tricked me. Uh, We are having a good day though, so maybe we'll attempt the mines again. And I'm gonna go try to buy a chicken. We'll see if I succeed. <laughs> cherry lucasade is so good too. I'm big on cherry. I can see why, again, I can see why people wouldn't like cherry flavoring, but I enjoy it. Okay, are you open today? You are. Hi. Purchase animals. Chicken. Only 800 gold. Okay. Chat? What is the... N oh. Bear with. Bear with. <laughs> Farmer got a hello. How are you? How was Minecraft today? Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome on in, raiders. You guys are new. My name is Crystal. We're doing a Stardew Valley Jojo run. It's my very first one. And we're about to buy our first chicken. So I was actually about to ask what we should name it. Uh, I don't know if we want to come up with a naming scheme for said chickens or if like you know we should just stick with the tried and true food names 
fuck. Oh, it's in dollar. True, we could do like money base names. Ketchup, egg, rosemary, nest egg. <laughs> nest egg. <laughs> I actually, that's actually kind of cute though. Oh, I have not. That's one thing I will admit. Um, I'm not big on chocolate mixed with fruit. Don't like those. Oh man, but thank you so very much for the uh, follow, uh, for the raid. I really, really do appreciate that. Um, and just fair warning, it's bad timing, but we do have an ad break coming up that I can't delay any longer, I don't think. After different currencies, maybe. Coconut sprinkles and chocolate is so good. Coconut and chocolate, like, I can, I can mess with, but like orange or cherry, um, not big with chocolate. Making black pepper garlic tater tots. Oh, that sounds good though. You know what? I really like the nest egg name. I'm gonna stick with that one. That one's a cute idea. I don't know whose idea that was, but thank you. All right. There we go. Nest egg. Was that you? I like it. I'll send the little nest egg to our new home right away. I forgot that you don't get to like choose the, the color of chicken. It's fine either way, obviously, but. Can't wait for my dinner, actually. Chicken Caesar salad and cheese and broccoli. Oh, friends, I had mash last night. <laughs> I have mashed potatoes. I was living my best life. I usually only get it around like Thanksgiving and Christmas. But we had uh, mashed potatoes and uh, barbecue ribs, actually. It was tasty. Nest egg? Nest egg? Hello? Oh, you're teeny! I... I didn't remember that they come small. Okay, well, I'll leave the door open for you. Oh, there you are. Nesta is like, I'm going for that fresh grass. Screw that hay you just put in for me. Okay. Smash shot season for breakfast hash since raw potatoes will take forever. Can't. You also can if you back out and reselect the animal. Keep rerolling the color. I do remember that. Yeah. I remember doing that. Either way, though, for our, for our, our farm here, we're not fussed about what color other than blue. And we can't get blue yet, so. Slime Hunter. Yeah, sure, I'm going down here anyway. Switch to Jojo while my crops are all for the purpose of money. Of getting a mod. Oh, so you can pick the color. Try to decide what to do. My mom sent me my birthday gifts early, so I'm trying to decide if I should open them now or wait for the proper day. Um, I'd say wait for the proper day, personally. Uh, but if you couldn't wait, like maybe like open like one or however many there are leading up to said day. Oh, I love chocolate covered raisins. <laughs> Apparently I do have things that I like chocolate and fruit together, but still. <laughs> I'm gonna do work today, but I'm still tired from travel yesterday. So rest day, that sounds good. We named the chicken uh, nest egg. Nest egg goes with the Joja theme. Oh, we have the train going by. No, oh, it's super good with chocolate, licorice. Mm. You know what, Rickslade? I've seen... Oh, Han, was it you who showed me that video? Oh, no, wait, that was a Markiplier video, wasn't it? Uh, do you remember he was doing that candy, all this candy from a certain place, and it was, like, mainly 90% licorice? Oh. 
if it was... I don't remember if it was from Norway or not. Yeah, something like that. Um, but yeah, I've never heard of chocolate and licorice together before that video. Okay, so. I need to take on jellies here. Oh my god, there's so many sun sprites. Um, oh, there we go. There's the floor. Or the... Not the floor. That is the stairs down to the next floor. Um, I would also like some iron, though. Chocolate-covered plum. They're even worse than chocolate-covered cherries. I have not heard of those either, actually. Yeah, you're right. I mean, the floor is also there. It's true. It's true. We do also have the floor. Which is good. If we didn't, I'd, I'd have concerns. Oh god, okay. There we go. Oh, hi. Came over to say hello. Yep, yeah, I agree. Panic is a good idea if there's no floor. <laughs> So just one more, one more slime and we are good. But is the floor made out of floor? I mean, what the floor is made out of comes together to make up the floor. How do we get into this? <laughs> It's made out of lava. I have more concerns, but also that's a couple floors down, random. We'll get there eventually. Ooh, nice. Second dwarf scroll, I think that is. People aren't afraid of heights, they're afraid of falling. Yeah. I think that's a very valid fear, though, honestly. make it down this time. Yep. That's all the slimes we needed. Are you afraid of heights, Itsu? I've never been one to mind heights. I don't like uh, roller coasters that go upside down, but I don't mind tall heights and spinning and all that other good stuff. It's just upside down I don't like. There we go. Jeez, that took a while. Even with an updated sword or upgraded. Even seeing tall things. Oh, really? I had no idea. Jerks and you, I'm afraid of both heights and falling. <laughs> Jacob, what are you afraid of? Yes. Honestly, me, though. I'm a very nervous person in general. Everything be a little scary. Okay, so we already got that one. This is like the same floor I made it to last time. Game be nice. Give me... Okay, there we go. <laughs> I was gonna say, give me the ladder. Scared of birds? Also fair. Yeah, I'm scared of large birds. I don't want any harm to come to them, you know? But they just kind of freak me out. They're just big. <gasps> scared of horses! Yeah. With horses, it's always been my idea that, like, you know, treat them with respect. Give them space. Don't mess with them, because those things will mess you up. <laughs> Oh my god, the 
calmer they were. Don't come near me ever, I will cry. <laughs> I'm also afraid, apparently, of mascot characters. That's a new one I didn't know until... Was it last year? Floor 70, we got the Master Slingshot. Nice, that was a good day. Uh, okay, so we'll talk to Lewis tomorrow. College made me do an assignment. We had to take photos. Handling animals. I had to hold a chicken and a duck, both photos. I was crying and had to submit that to your tutor. Oh no! <laughs> Faye, that sounds awful. I can't believe they made you go through with it. More normal than all the people I've seen online who are apparently turned on by them. Okay, yeah, that's- that's- I can't understand that, but... I guess to each their own? Okay, uh, so this gets put in there. Student scare snakes got to hold. A fake snake, but wouldn't let me hold a fake chicken or duck. No, no, that's that's actually silly. I would have thrown such a stink about that. What's a mascot character? Um, so like when you go to Disney, like Mickey Mouse, like the walking around characters with the big heads and stuff. Fur suits. Those scare me. <laughs> Apparently. Um, and I don't think I had that fear as a child. Because I, you know, I've been to amusement parks and didn't really have a problem. Uh, it was when we happened to walk into a Toys R Us, which still exists here. Oh, uh, I can't remember which one. I think it's Tiller that I want here. Um, and there was a, I think his name is Jeffrey the Giraffe mascot character wandering around. Um, Mike thought I was joking, but I most certainly wasn't. I was actually, like, having a fight or flight moment. This thing was horrifying. Okay, um, yeah, it's Tiller, because that gets us into Artisan. Uh, yeah. Yep, we've got Artisan, that's what we want. The Toys R Us giraffe one is scary. He was scary, it was horrifying. Apparently, also, we had to walk right past it to leave the store, and Mike said that the suit smelled awful. I didn't smell anything, that's how much in shock I was. I was just like... Tunnel visioning my visioning, sorry, my way out of that store. <laughs> uh yes. They changed the rules after I submitted photos of me crying. <laughs> oh wow, we had seven thousand seven hundred and seventy-seven money that day. It was a lucky day. FNAF in real life. <laughs> and like I know at the end of the day. Um, it was probably just like some teenager working, like, you know their part-time job for Toys R Us in that suit, but it still scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Tool D and Dumb chased me in Disneyland once, did not enjoy. Yeah, you know what? Uh, I've only been to Disney the one time, um, but I distinctly remember feeling like we were being followed around by either Chip and or Dale. I'm not sure which one was which. Because um, they just kept kind of following after us. I don't know if we were on their route or what, but... Level 20 with more perks. Ooh, random. That's a good answer, actually. A question of the day, if you guys haven't already answered. Um, in the 1.6 update for Stardew, what would you like to see added? Maybe 14. Absolutely hate it. have not been back to Disney since. You're scared of the mic sniffs them. <laughs> Once in Nickelodeon hotels, lifeless, smiling SpongeBob. Yeah, I. I mean, if you've ever seen the pictures of like the original Mickey Mouse mascot costume from like the '60s, it's scary. The old ones don't look good. What 
characters to do stuff. They always walk somewhere and just stand. Yeah, they, they don't really have like a lot going on. I think the worst is Marnie and Shane who just stare at the microwave for like hours at a time. I have, Itsu, I have. Those are horrifying. Those are not okay. Also, I think we have enough money for our next Jojo upgrade here. Oh wait, no, that, that is not what I want to do today. Collective fear of mascots and fursuits. <laughs> You know it. All right. I can't even see you. You're so small, nest egg. Come here. There you go. Oh my God, Nook. Oh, he was. He was sleeping right in front of the uh, the greenhouse. Oh, one of the trees is done. Nice. What do I need to make these? Wood and copper. Okay. Cool. You know what, actually? I don't think I'm going to fish today. I think I'm going to work on uh, uh, clearing out more land. I go the mask. That's a nightmare feel. Yeah, I think it was meant to, like, make kids feel more comfortable with, like, the scary stuff that was going on. But honestly, it's a little scary in and of itself. Waiting for rich book news. Yeah, fair. There we go. I really should have put them all on at the same time. It has now dawned on me, but it's fine. We're just going to deal with it. Okay, let's go try to get our uh, Joja upgrade and our trash can hat, hopefully. Hey, Emma, how are you? Uh, a super cucumber. Oh, I forgot you can fish. When do you fish those up? Uh, yeah, you're right, hon. At night, ocean. Ginger Island. Okay. Cool. Um, I'll accept I probably won't get it done, but why does she want a super cucumber? We don't ask questions. We just deliver and expect payment. Oh. <laughs> Lewis must really hate me. <laughs> it's all good. We don't care. I can't remember if I gave... I didn't. I need to go talk to Shane again, too. Feels good giving jail time this time. Get all of that in now, because once Rebirth comes out, it's gonna be all on us. today. That's okay, though. Oh, wait, Jojo. Right, right, right. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. Now there's a reason I was going to be here. Got the Jojo Community Development Form right here for you, sir. Care to take a look? Yes. Oh, I could have gotten panning. You know what, chat? You know what? Also, there's only five things. I thought there were six. Um, I'm going to save up just a little bit more. I'm going to get that greenhouse. 
I'm gonna get that greenhouse. We gotta make the monies. The temptation is too strong. I'm gonna have to go in there and water every day, though. That kind of sucks. Am I any closer to getting the next level sprinklers? What level am I? Anyone know what level you get those the um, second level sprinklers from? See a lot of my man, the promotional stuff. I'm gonna be a mess. I think we're all just gonna be collectively a mess. <laughs> it's gonna be good. Um, okay, so I keep back here. Grab one of those for Shane. Six for quality. Perfect. Awesome. That might actually be... Well, I guess we didn't harvest anything today, did we? That was yesterday. Uh, hopefully next time we harvest something. Yeah. Um, we will get Iridium eventually. Obviously. <laughs> but not today. Yes, I have, Itzy. Yeah, I have. Seems like a mascot character who was in some old 90s commercial for Jojo Mart. Everyone remembers them, but feels like they were a fever dream. Exactly, and we're actually like a real person. Oh, oh, there we go. Shane, I got your pepper. Now give me my blue chickens. I need them for me. His little uh, thing turned green. The little icon. Yeah, we're at two hearts. Soon, Shane, soon. I have never paid this much attention to Shane so early on. <laughs> I've never romanced him before, never had an interest. Um, it is the blue percent run, yep. But he has the blue chickens and I, I need them for me. we got going on here just talk to Shane for the blue chickens other than that I ignore him yeah you guys think we got enough grass I think we could use a little more, personally. Mary Shane, his depression is relatable. Yeah, I got I got nothing against him. It's just generally someone who I never go after. I think you got the most hearts with Shane. <laughs> Slap Shane with a pizza until he married me. I mean, to be fair, you know. Pizza is delicious. <laughs> Mike Tron, you have an amazing day at work. We'll see you next time. all this grass will be snow. That's true. I gotta keep that in mind because I had the uh, winter grass mod last time I played. I gotta be careful that I don't forget about that. <laughs> but now that we have the coop, by the way, um, oh, I don't think I can do it. Oh, I can. You can take out hay and like store it in a bin.
There we go. So it's like a hundred of it right there, right? Game looks very cozy. Oh my goodness, Upper Castle. It is. It is. It's a lot of fun. Uh, and then I can just chop down more hay. <laughs> Uh, I'm actually just gonna go sit in the bathhouse for a bit. Oh yeah, no, no, always, always get the silo first. That's one of my first, like, to-do things in Stardew. I kind of wish that was the tutorial quest too, instead of build the coop. It should have been, uh, build the silo and then maybe a different quest to build the coop or a further quest to build it. So I guess tomorrow might turn into a fishing day. <laughs> Dishes done, emotional support, G-Field tan snack, perhaps. <laughs> I I like snack, yes. I think that should be the answer here. I love the emotional support G fuel though. <laughs> wish it was faster. It'd be cool if you could go up onto the second floor there. I think there's probably a mod that actually does do that for you. Um, so it's kind of similar to a lot of other farming games where like you have X amount of years in this game three um, to essentially win your grandfather's approval. Um, and that's based off of various factors, various things you can do in the game. Um, the game doesn't end or anything like that if you don't meet his criteria. Uh, and it continues going either way. Um, there's a lot of end game stuff though. <laughs> um, the game kind of really opens up towards the end actually. Oh, like I really hope you have an amazing time. First Moon Story Seasons is front runners for farm sims. Yeah, Stardew really opened up the whole farming sim genre and a lot more games came out. Birthday cruise! Oh my god, that emote looks kind of scary with the chat. <laughs> Resisting the urge to play Harvest Moon 64 now that it's on Switch. Oh, you should check it out! I was playing it actually not that long ago. I was enjoying it. I have no idea what I'm doing in it, but I guess that's kind of the fun part, right? Yeah, you're gonna go big. That's so exciting. Wonder when they'll announce a new story seasons. I mean, I know that they mentioned that they are working on a new story seasons that's gonna be like brand new, not a remake. And also multiplayer, right? I'd like to hear more about what they're doing there. Yeah, Harvest Moon 64 shares the same characters, although some of them are very different between games, as uh, Friends of Mineral Town. And um, Back to Nature. Back to Nature, and then that's what Friends of Mineral Town is based on. It gets kind of confusing. <laughs> oh, there we go. I was having some trouble aiming there. There we go. That's a lot more clear. Do 
Japan during the summer. Is that also for your birthday? Oh my goodness. Really going big. Played tons of Harvest Moon 64 back in the day. I, uh, I unfortunately didn't have a N64 to play it on, but I remember being really fascinated with the idea of it. the 3D Harvest Moon game you were playing when I first spoke in here, but I can never remember which one. My guess is probably um, A Wonderful Life because I was playing it on YouTube at the time and I was probably going through and trying to finish um, up like some of the extra chapters in that game. Me and my mom are going to go nuts. It'll be all over for us. I know. Mike and I are always on the eye out for multiplayer games, kind of like that. So I know we'll be on it too. Okay, so tomorrow is sunny again. Today is a great day. We're definitely going to go fishing. Uh, Jojo, I'm getting data on the correlation between soil uh, and... Long story short, need fresh melon from your farm. Okay. Got you. Can do. Message me about it after stream because you were talking about it and not playing it. Oh, weird. I don't remember streaming any other 3D Harvest Moons around that point, though. check what uh, the lightning rods take to craft because like I mentioned yesterday I tend to make my fences out of those yeah no I hadn't played Harvest Moon 64 until very recently thank you for the follow welcome on in my only guess it's is maybe save the homeland but I don't remember ever streaming that game Oh, you have a nine hour shift. I hope that your work day goes well. Thank you so much for hanging out with us for a bit. Okay, uh, so I already handed Shane all of his peppers for this week. Uh, that's weird. I thought I had a melon in here already. throw it in here? No, oh, weird. Maybe I just sold them all. Yeah, I probably sold it. Alright, let me go ahead and see here. Um, delightful welcome on in. Uh, so, he's meant to be a little Shiba dog. Long story short, uh, our mascot, his name is Tater Tot. We call him Tater. He's based on... Oh, where is it? There we go. This little plush that I uh, I was gifted and uh, chat named him Tater Tot. Um, I've had people mention hamster, like gopher weasels, <laughs> like everything but a dog. <laughs> um, but that's okay. Tater is just kind of Tater. see here. Hey, Katie. So your very first YouTube Let's Play recently. I must say it's actually pretty good. Like for sure, it may not be perfect quality, but for back then, pretty new YouTube channel, and honestly, for 2015, YouTube as a whole wasn't really bad. The only real gripe I had was your older videos. Yeah, it was abrupt endings. Thank you for watching that. Yeah, my you, everyone has to start somewhere, right? That's why I tend to leave out my old content. Uh Oh, there you are. 
Somewhere between dog and potato. Yeah, somewhere in that zone. Okay. Nook is like, I'm gonna nap with these trees. Why does my chicken coop have two doors? It has a people door and a animal shutter. You can let the animals in and out. Or you can go in and out. <laughs> Chicken's a <done. laughs> Oh god. Tater knows no gender or species. They're just tater. <laughs> oh, I love that. I know, right? I remember so vividly when Stardew came out that it's a little crazy to think how old it actually is. And the fact that we're still getting free content updates for it. Uh, I might go in the mines tomorrow, so I'll, I'll just accept that one here. Right, if we are fishing by or after six o'clock, we might be able to find that. Nope, no trash can hat still, one day. That scared me. That went up really high. Was that just because I got a good item or like what happened? I accidentally throwing out my sword. There's the clip. There it is. I remember that moment so well. God, that was funny. I had I wasn't used to playing on I think that controller yet. I believe it was. And uh, I accidentally threw out my sword. <laughs> oh, that was funny. I don't! I don't! That was- that was a good time. Oh, there we go. New item for the museum. That was, uh... That was before I was dating Mike. He was there. I remember him being in chat, but that was before I was dating Mike. That's scary. <laughs> what did I just do? <laughs> I love that. Oops. That was my fault. I had a very different microphone. It was quite obviously a bit younger. I remember. It's so unfortunate because, like, you know, obviously everyone has to start somewhere with their audio and equipment and stuff. But I used to have the, the Blue Yeti microphone, which was such a sucker for just any little noise. It could pick up anything. <laughs> very echoey. There's ways and means to make it sound better, but that thing is... Ooh. Man, it's painful. Anyway, um, I had it sitting on my desk, which is like the biggest no-no because it'll pick up all the reverb from you hitting your desk. And um, I was playing uh, City Folk and a tarantula came by and like, it's a very funny clip. I've seen it. It's one of my more viewed clips on here. And so I freak out, but I also smash my desk in the process. And uh, of course that picked up, and it makes the clip sound so much worse. I have a Blue Yeti and it picks up every little tap. It really, really does. Lichaton, hello! How are you doing? Can we get a shout out? Well, come on in. I hope you've been having a good one. There's the tarantula sighting. Yeah. 
I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We're doing our uh, our first ever JoJo run here, which has been very interesting. <laughs> it's a really different way of playing Stardew than I'm used to, but it's been fun. There we go. Blue Monkey Girl, welcome on in, everyone. If you guys are just joining us, by the way, question of the day is uh, what would you like to see added to the 1.6 update for Stardew? If, if anything. <laughs> Nothing or I don't play Stardew is a very valid answer. There we go. Well, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. And Haynes, how are you? Hope you're having- oh god, hi. Hello. Fishy, please. I hope you're having a good day. Okay. Yes. There we go. Good. Oh, I don't like whatever you are. <laughs> are you the octopus again? Oh, 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 I was doing so well. Well, this thing really doesn't want to be caught. I will respect that. You know what? I'll let you go. <laughs> you do you. But yeah, for uh, things added to Stardew, I was thinking um, adding in a length of day slider or adjustment feature or something in the settings menu so your days might go by a lot more quickly or a lot more slowly, depending on what you choose. Um, I never really saw the use of that until I played games like Sandrock or Porsche that did have it and it was so handy. <laughs> it's so nice. Oh, oh, there we go. I should roast dinner and now it's time to chill. Oh, nice. Very nice. Oh, three fish bait. Making progress on your hunt. Wait, what are we hunting? Wait, did I miss something? I've missed something. Oh, right, you're looking for, for what we, um, what we were talking about, what game I was playing. Yes. I think I like more spouse, family life events or activities. Yeah. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Thank you for joining me. Um, I think after playing Story of Seasons, A Wonderful Life, like, the original is absolutely one of my favorite games of all time, and that remake did it justice. They added in so many cutscenes with your wife or your spouse and your child. Um, it would be nice to see more of that, but I know in this game, your, your kids don't really ever age up beyond, like, being a toddler, right? <laughs> oh, I remember the glitch path. So after we're in about like 30 in-game minutes, the super cucumber apparently should start spawning.
Uh, okay. Let's see. Maybe we'll get it right away. Maybe we won't. Maybe I won't be able to catch it. <laughs> Wasn't having luck with whatever that was earlier, so. But yeah, for those just joining us, we are currently saving up. I'm kind of skipping ahead a bit. I'm trying to get the greenhouse as quickly as possible here. Uh, I've bought one Joja upgrade. Um, there are apparently five in total. I thought there were six. Um, and I think getting the greenhouse probably be the, uh, the best decision money-wise. Not that I found our uh, our ancient fruit yet. That might be it, because according to the wiki, the super cucumber is like a sinker. Apparently fish have different, like, um, behavioral patterns, which I think is really neat. There we go. There it is. Nice. Um, so that's going to be tomorrow. Okay. Let's go see if I can't catch her right now. Seems just to buy all Jojo upgrades. Is it just the finishing the Jojo route? Or does everything need to be bought from Jojo? I think it's just the Jojo route, like just the just the greenhouse and vine carts and stuff. I think that's it as far as I know. But also I've never done it before, <laughs> so. Uh okay, good. She is here. That's exactly what I needed. I'm so happy. You're welcome. So that, 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 uh, that I need to donate. Maybe tomorrow we'll do a little stop off at the museum in the morning. decide what to make for dinner. What's everyone else having? Um, I don't know if we know what we're doing tonight. I was kind of contemplating being bad and having McDonald's. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Um, I don't know what else we might do tonight. We do have some pasta, I guess. We do not say that forbidden name at my house. You get so addicted to it. Oh, really? You know what? That's fair. We don't have it all that often. Not anymore. We used to have it quite a bit. Oh, really? Okay. I hadn't... I've heard supper and dinner used inter like interchangeably. Uh, but never dinner for like... The middle meal. <laughs> Level 9 fishing! Yes. I always want the breakfast so I never go there early enough. Yeah. <laughs> right outside my house. Like, I'm walking there back in five minutes. Oh, God. Yeah, we, uh, I lived like less than two blocks away from McDonald's in my last place. And there was many a night where my mom would either just come home with McDonald's because it was right near the bus stop. Um, or when we first moved in, 
uh, because we hadn't unpacked all of the kitchen stuff yet, we just kind of ate McDonald's for like two weeks straight. It was great. I was like, God, what was I? I would have been like nine, eight or nine. And I thought it was like the best thing in the world. <laughs> I think I'm just going to sell off the lower quality ones. I'll just give him high quality ones. So like I don't live in walking distance of any takeaways. Popped your tater tots in the oven. Don't put my boy in the oven. No, it's fine. <laughs> it's all good. Strawberry harvest is spring year four, which means they can collect all their strawberries on time. Oh, thank you. I always like to. Oopsies. I always like to do that just to avoid anything getting too close to my plants. I can't even remember if that affects them in this game. If like weeds or, or grass gets too close. Mike is saying it does, so. I probably started that for that reason and just kind of kept up with the tradition. <laughs> oh, Jesus, what I get for not paying attention. Um, I live walking distance from a Thai place and I go there so much just because it's there, yep. We also used to live pretty close to a pizza place too and that was pretty dangerous. Um, yeah, I guess I said mining today, right? Oh, hey, nest egg, you've grown up, baby. Look at you. Yay, first egg. Um, wait. Mmm, the first thing doesn't have an incubator, does it? Okay. There's a condo that has a bakery in the building, ice cream shop next door, McDonald's across the street. Oh, I would not survive. Too much good stuff. I had a friend who lived across the street from a bakery. And like every morning on the walk to school, because their their place is on the walk, or my walk towards the school, um, you would smell the bakery and it's just, oh, it's not fair. <laughs> Why not? I can do that. Garbage can hat. I believe. Apparently the game doesn't believe in me though. Nope. I got a pine cone. Oh, you know what? I was gonna, um a whole bunch of stuff over to donate to the museum. In two blocks I have a Japanese Korean restaurant, a Thai place, two pizza places, a pub, a Turkish restaurant, a family restaurant, and numerous fast food options. Oh, and a sushi place. Oh my goodness. You have so much choice. back for a second. I'm going to pick up a hot pepper for Maru and actually one for Shane now that I'm thinking about it. We have a pizza place right by us too, but it's kind of bad. Oh, I mean, you know, I guess that's kind of a deterrent. I'm broke, so I eat tuna out of a packet for lunch. <laughs> you know, some people are into it. Um, right, okay, so donate. Uh, those I can just sell off. Nope. Yep. Think I had anything else? I thought I had a lot more than this. I guess not. Assess, donate everything. 
see Shane, she, uh, see Maru, and then we're gonna go mining. <laughs> Treasure Trove. What's that one for? 40 different items to the museum. Oh, we're so far off from the 100. <laughs> I didn't realize how far off we were. I've sent a lot of chats in here. You have it, Sue, but I do appreciate it. Um, Does Shane work today? No? I guess not. Maybe I'll try to catch him at the bar later if I leave late enough. Um, I don't know. I guess it's probably open today. Oh, or no one's here. Okay. Harvey? Maru? Anyone? Okay, Harvey's there. Let's see here. I can't remember which rare crow it was that I was missing for my uh, my perfection run. I know there was one that took me a while to get. Uh, and then I think there was also like a recipe or something I needed to learn on the island. I can't remember exactly what it was now. Like, you know, two o'clock <laughs> and we're finally entering the mines. Yeah, that's probably it, honestly. It was something like someone specific need to go to the island, I think. And then I need to catch them there and get the recipe from them. Still only in 2023. I love the frozen cave level. Same here. I think they're actually my favorite, other than the uh, the volcano over on the island. Gus, yes, 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 yes. It's definitely ringing a bell. Ooh, we got an Omni Geode. Cool. drop the stairs. <laughs> Finally made it back to 2023. Ooh, uh, Dwarf Scroll 4, I think that is. So I think we're just missing three now. Oh, 
Only six years left to go. I've been streaming for too long, clearly. It's okay though, once you get back to like 2018, I didn't have time to stream as often. So it'll it'll be a bit more uh, sparse. Only one Sonic game in those eight years. I mean, yeah. And you know what? We haven't played Wind Waker enough. <laughs> Definitely two. We did murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm gonna count that. Shoo, go away. There we go. Time to make it three. Oh, I don't know about that. I still got a couple months left before random can start asking again. You know what I never looked into? I thought we needed bat wings for that. Okay. Um, cool, we can start making those when we get back. So one technically though, adventure wasn't beaten. No, I beat, what was it, one six of adventure? <laughs> That was, that was enough for little old me, I think. That count for fulfilling the deal. No, you need to stream like an entire stream of Final Fantasy VII Remake, please. I'm up in the ante. <laughs> There we go. 475. That's actually in really good time, too. I didn't think we were going to make that. Uh, let's go try to find Shane. You want my laptop to blow up? Oh, true, true, true. Oh. I didn't find any slimes in that period? Oh, I thought I... <laughs> Alright, screw me then. I thought I did. Oh, well. Actually, you know what, random? How about this? I raise you the fact that the PlayStation can stream directly to Twitch. How about that? Does that count? You don't need your laptop for it. You know what? Here, you can guard the farm. Uh, so I need to donate. I'm gonna keep. I guess I'm kind of keeping a lot of this, actually. Got lucky with a double diamond earlier. I still have a little bit of time. Um, so I'm just gonna work on clearing out a little bit more space here. I'm also gonna throw in some more uh, iron because we are gonna start working on uh, lightning rods. Oh wait, heck, I need the refined quartz too. I guess we're not working on that quite yet. Soon though. Once I pay off our next Joja thing, I'm gonna save up a little bit again, upgrade this to a iron um, axe, break my way into the uh, 
I've always called it the Secret Forest. I don't know if that's actually the name or not. Either way, <laughs> break my way in there. Save up for our horse and our stable. Uh, I think it might, but I'm not actually entirely sure. I know, I know what you're talking about. I just don't know which scenes it would block, if any, from remake. Probably like final scenes and stuff. Um, 2021. I have no idea. I have no idea what I could have been playing. I have concerns, though. A little nightmares. Oh! That was that long ago, really. Wow. <laughs> That feels like yesterday. That was traumatic. I did not enjoy that. It was a scary game. Um, oh, we're so close. We're so close to getting enough money. It's gonna rain tomorrow. We're having not such a great day today. Oh, but it is a blueberry day though. Oh my goodness me. Get your pop cats ready, chat. Uh, alright, I'm gonna throw some of this in here. All right, everyone ready? I will start us off. And... <laughs> Anticlimactic, excuse me, sir. There we go. I can't wait to get a bigger, a uh, bigger? No, a bigger field for more blueberry popping action. Oh God, I've ruined the pattern, oh no. Oh dear, don't worry about it, chat. It's okay. A little anticlimactic, but it's good. We love a good pop cat session. Okay, so tomorrow we're definitely gonna have enough money. But if I just sell off a little something today. This is a guy they were talking about that uh, blue David <laughs> It is! It is. I need a blue Corvette and a blue little window still, though. Actually, I guess I could probably just, like... Let me see here. I probably have stuff I could sell. I probably don't need a cauliflower. It really goes against my nature to sell anything, Chad. I'm not very good at this. I want to hoard absolutely anything I can get my hands on. Uh... Shane. I should probably just make some more furnaces sometime. Ton of mod PC versions that everything is a blue color palette. <laughs> I could probably do something actually through OBS to legitimately make everything on screen blue, but uh, I think that would be. I just feel like it'd be kind of hard to look at after a while. Hi, Unicorn, how are you? Welcome on in. We are so close to getting our next Joja upgrade here. So, so close. And I still haven't found my hat. I'm working on it though. Shane, come here. For you. I hardly know you. Why are you talking to me? You still accept my hot peppers every couple of days, so I'm just saying. This reflex works on you, then it does on me. Did I not water my crops? I didn't. Got some stuff to do, but for now, you're just chilling. I hope you can get your stuff done. One seventh of the rainbow redeemed to turn you blue for the purpose of Stardew Valley Jojo run only. Actually, I could actually do that, I think. Uh, I could probably figure out a way to do that. 
redeem could be called like had too much Joja blue or something or Joja cola whatever it's called nope not today okay can I sell stuff at Joja Okay, doesn't look like it. Is it actually called Jojo Blue? I couldn't remember if I was making that up or not. Thank you for making, uh, what's the word? Reassuring me. Okay. I'm trying to use my mouse. Oh, bless. Okay. Yeah, all right, we have enough. It's time. We're gonna have 197 monies left to our name. But everything for Jojo chat. Let's be a mattress cleaning the shelf, but the boys want some room this time. Or this morning, so you can't kick them out yet. He is a Krobus and he is also blue. <laughs> Just turn poor Krobus blue. All right, give me the greenhouse. Yeah! Excellent, we'll get our workers on it tonight. It should be ready for you by tomorrow. Awesome, I have no money. This is great. <laughs> um, but you know what? We did just sell blueberries, so we'll, we will have some money by tomorrow again. I haven't even found an ancient seed yet, no. No, I was debating what I should fill it up with. Um... I think technically the star fruit is the best. Oh wait. Wait, star fruit doesn't refresh itself, does it? Yeah, Mike's saying no. Um, I'm tempted just to go with something that refreshes itself, to be honest, just so we can be, you know, lazy. Um I might just go cranberries. I might just wait a couple days to go cranberry. Because I think those are better than blueberries. I didn't buy strawberries because I'm silly and I completely forgot even though I was talking about it. Oh my god, that quote is so out of context. I just want everyone to know, okay? 90% of the quotes are very, very out of context. grow. They're really growing at different rates here too. I don't know if they just operate on some sort of like chance to grow each day or progress to the next stage or what but <laughs> it's <laughs> Hundred and fifty times someone in this chat has said something that deserved jail time. I'm just saying. That's quite a lot. <laughs> that is quite a lot of uh, silliness. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Hope you're having a great day. I don't think I have. No, I think you've been pretty good. Here, I thought that was lower than expected. I mean, to be fair, it kind of is. Still a lot, but... To be- also, that wasn't from the very beginning as well. I think jail is relatively new. 
There's a chance guaranteed if you use tree fertilizer market trees have lower rates and aren't guaranteed. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that command was only made relatively recently. I say relatively because like everything feels recently, but apparently COVID was four years ago. So like, you know. I was trying to be respectful in chat, but I'm sure in other chats I've been to horny jail. <laughs> I do appreciate it. Alrighty. Um, let's go. Go to the hot springs for a bit. It's okay, rebirth will take us to 900. More like 9,000. Ancient seed. I'm pretty sure I've fished it up before, but you can. Can you also get it from dig spots or no? You can, I think. Yeah, it's that's ringing a bell. Slowly becoming the favorite of children while at work because my hair is a gradient of magenta to blue. <laughs> but to be fair, that is very cool. I'm still in 2021. I really have not left 2020. Can't believe it's been April 2020 for 46 months. <laughs> it's been a long time, friends. Yeah, I, I was thinking the mines as well, Deadly Sin. You're probably absolutely right. I've actually accidentally distracted my manager because of my hair. Oh, I thought you meant like mentally and it was it was very fitting for the conversation, Etsu, to be fair. You got your food, enjoy your food. Even if you're eating tater tots. And I'm a little jealous. <laughs> Looking forward to this all day. Yeah, that's always the best when you know what you're having for dinner and you're like excited for it. Okay, we got full health again. This is a mood. <laughs> Look at you napping. Right in the middle of the walkway, as cats always do. Actually, I lie. Ollie's pretty good about that. He doesn't usually lay anywhere too weird. Bugs, grubs, cave flies, mutant flies, and mutant grubs. Stardew Valley Wiki. Any enemy that can drop bug me. Oh, interesting. How is that a higher chance to drop than my garbage can hat? <laughs> Man, I... We'll get it. It'll happen. Hey, Fenix, how are you today? Welcome on in. If you or anyone else are just joining us, we are obviously playing some more Stardew today. Uh, we have just actually paid off the greenhouse, which was, I think, the most expensive uh, of the upgrades, I believe, for Joja. Um, but we kind of saved up and got it second because I feel like it'll really speed us along, especially if we got sprinklers going. Ancient Seed has a 0 0.7 to 8 chance from a treasure chest and 3.7% from an artifact trove as well. Okay. All very good to know. I just like to point out I really appreciate how Stardew Valley Wiki virus has spread to not only my own computer, but everyone else's. <laughs> People looking up stuff on the wiki you're not even playing, but I do appreciate it. Yep, yeah, we've gone the Jojo route. We have we have sold out. Um, we've been making the big monies. 
Well, I mean, I say that. We, we really haven't. We I don't have any money right now. <laughs> but it's for the good of Joja. Oh, you'll get it back. That's good to know. Disgusting. I know. I know. No, honestly, Jojo's actually been very interesting. It ch kind of challenges the way I play Stardew. Because I always like to just hoard everything. Anything I get my hands on, I need, like, several copies of. And, you know, I always keep everything just in case. But this go-around, because I'm just selling everything for money, I don't really keep anything. We join Joja and are thriving. <laughs> Thriving with 197 gold in our bank account. <laughs> okay, actually, while I'm here as well, by the way, uh, I think... Should be able to make a couple of those. Um, no, there we go. Oh, effect, it has started, friends. go. Oh, it was raining overnight, too. Whoopsies. <laughs> oh, there we go. That was... Uh, ship 300 of one crops. That was the blueberries. Thriving in the rain. <laughs> Be sitting inside, buddy. All right, so before we continue forwards, friends, I do think this is a good chance for me to get up and go on a quick stretch break. You guys want to join me? Get up, stretch, grab a drink, grab a snack. You guys have heard the spiel before. Do what you gotta do. If you are headed out, thank you so much for hanging out. But if you're going to stick around, enjoy the BRB videos. And uh, I'll see you all here in about 10 minutes. <laughs> 